Hope you're all well, it is Mr. Palmer here. We're on to week six now of our home skills challenges. So again, trying to keep it fresh, trying to do new things. We are gonna go with the speed challenge this week, okay? So our speed challenge is gonna be working on how quickly we can move around the circuit, okay? So different to last week when we did different exercises, it's gonna all be about how fast we can move and how quickly we can get our feet and our bodies working. Good luck with it, I hope to see you. So guys, on our speed challenge this week, we are gonna be focusing on your SAQ movements, which are your speed, agility, and quickness. To set this little circuit, little session up, you are going to need five markers. Now I've used cones, again you can use anything around the house. Just make sure you've asked your parents first if it's okay to use. Or have something nice and small and soft ideally. Okay, if you've got cones, fantastic. Alright, you're going to set them up in a little square. Okay, so it's a one stride square. Okay, with one cone in the centre. Okay, we're going to work a little square circuit. It's all going to be about how quickly we can move our feet. Really fast, small contact on the floor, quick change of direction. Once we complete one lap of this box, that gets us one point. Okay, you're going to get one minute to score as many full points, full circuit laps as you can, and then try and complete and beat that throughout the week. So if I just walk through first, if you start from any one of your corner cone, we're going to keep our bodies facing forward at all times, never turn around. We are going to come around that centre cone each time. Now you can go over it any way you like. You've got to complete all four, get back to the start. So you watch. I'm going to ground there. I'm going to twist my body, come back around this one. And then work around it again. And round the top. Come back around again to go around this one. And then I'm going to get myself back into position at number one. That would be one circuit done. So if I show you that now nice and quickly, see how I'm on my toes and I'm working my arms in tandem with my feet. Work out, wrap across, and around, all different types of movement, good. Working there, and I get back to the starting position. That's one. Two, and so on and so forth, as many as you can do inside one minute. Now you can tell this is gonna be really tough, okay? It's gonna get you out of breath, okay? It's gonna make you really, really get yourself working hard. So stick at it, have a go at it, wait a little bit, try another, try and beat your score, okay? You're doing great with these at the minute, make sure you keep it up. It's a good job from everybody. Hope